Hello and welcome to another Raggy's Beer Review. So today we're going to be reviewing Cruz Campo. <laughs> so Cruz Campo, if you know about Madri, I've actually got a can of Madri up there somewhere. Um, if you know about Madri, Madri is, I think, Marston's Spanish lager that they brought out. Colesburg Marston's, whatever they call themselves these days. And as far as I know, Cruz Campo is like the Carling, Molson Coors Carling version of a Spanish lager. So, yeah, not actually made in Spain, made in the UK. But let's get into it. That's what I've heard anyway. Uh, I got this from Morrison's. Um, yeah. Big promotion in Morrison's. It says Cruz Campo, Sevilla, Desde 1904. So, yeah, I mean, it may well be 1904. Cerveza de Andalusia, España. Cruz Campo, Sevilla. Brewed in the UK by Heineken. <clears throat> in Edinburgh, so it says 4.4 percent. So we damn well know it wasn't brewed in Spain. Um, but we'll give it a punt and we'll see how it cooks. You know, we'll be re, we'll be re, and we'll see how it goes. So I've actually never, um, I know all about Cus Campo, I've seen it advertised. Uh, I've actually never had a drink of it, not on cask, not on, sorry, cask, on, not in a pub or anything. So crystal clear, golden pour, white head, good lots of carbonation going up. Bear in mind, this is a beer glass, not a lager glass. In a lager glass, it would be a lot more. For a beer glass, that's, that's quite, a, a, quite a bit of carbonation. Got to be honest, typical lager malt nose. Yeah, it just smells like lager. Yeah, there's there's nothing, you know, that says, oh, I'm different. Drink me. No, no, it just smells like a clean, crisp lager. Right, let's dive in. Lager taste, faint cardboard um, taste in the background. Why the fuck do you get cardboard in, in lager? Well, as long as got, it's a bit bland, if I'm being honest. Um, I'm going to give it a punt. You know, I've got a 660ml bottle. It's got about 10 minutes to review it. So let's drink it like a lager person would. It's crisp, refreshing, drinkable, albeit bland. I mean, it's not nasty or anything, it's just fucking boring. Um, I'm not getting a note from it. Note. I ought to have got the, the Madri can out and the Madri versus Chris Campo. Wow. Hmm. Um... What are them times where you drink it and you're like, but what's, what's, what's different about this? You know, I can't pick anything out. There's, there's nothing, just a lager. Um, I'm not getting anything that says, you know, a taste of this, a hint of something. Uh, I'm just getting like a lager malt, you know, like a typical lager. I 
I'm trying to go for pluses now because I'm I'm getting a bit I'm a bit bland at the moment. Well, fucking bit lager is. Um, and obviously Morrison's are pushing this. Well, they're Morrison's these days. Jesus Christ, their pricing structure is uh, strange. <clears throat> Whoever does their prices needs to look at the other supermarkets and think, Jesus, our prices are a bit high. Um, you fucking are. Um, £2.75 for rain rights. And I'm like, that was a pound last year. How the fuck are you charged £2.75 for it? I mean, it's okay for, you know, it's a Marston's beer. So, you know, Marston's have ruined brands. Um, but... I mean, I'm not, I'm not a snob, craft beer snob, or, you know, I've never been in that category, never will be. If I like something, I like something, and I don't give a shit what anybody else thinks. But, um, but also, you know, if it's something shit, it's shit. Uh, and I'm not doing it because, you know, I'm trying to make a statement. I'm, I'm doing it because, you know, no, yeah, shit. <laughs> There's a buggy thing on me light. The light don't work anymore anyway, so but there's a buggy thing on it. Uh I'm absolutely freezing my bits off. Um this is about as interesting as dishwater. I'm trying to be really, really positive and Ooh. You put this against Estrella or San Miguel, they'd laugh. They would absolutely laugh. Now people might think, yeah, but you're being hard on Heineken or Molson calls or whoever makes the fucker. Um, no, I'm not. But I'm telling you now that San Miguel and especially in Spain and Estrella and again, especially in Spain uh, absolutely kicks the arse of this. It's as boring a bloody lager as you can get. Um, Kinda knew it before I drank it because I've 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 read what people have said. Uh, it's a strange old name as well, Cruz Campo. So where did they drag that out from? You know, nineteen oh four. Fucking nineteen oh four. Why have I never heard of it in supermarkets before now? So I'm letting the air get to it, to see if it improves, see if it develops some interesting um, aspects. Hmm. Oh dear, I've just... I try not to get them pre-concepts when I look at, when I look at a beer and I've, I've already made my mind up before the beer comes. But this is one where you, 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 op you, you start with an open book and then you look at it and you think, mm, okay. You smell it and you think, mm, okay. And then you drink it and you're like, oh no. It's exactly as bad as everybody else was saying it was. Um, oh dear. Yeah, still getting that fake cardboard as well. Um, lager malt nose, lager malt taste, a um, little bit of faint cardboard, like I say. Um, Morrison's are pushing this massively. They've got a big plinth going off. Obviously, um, Eiley can pay for that, you know. Um, it's... 
if I'm talking to anybody who likes a lager, but likes a decent lager, then no, avoid. Um, it's very bland. It's, yeah, it's lager. But there's nothing special about it in any way, sense or form. It's as boring as you can get. Um, bland as hell. Um, yeah, very disappointed. Uh, I've drank Madri. Yeah, Madri's not fantastic, but bloody hell, it kicks the arse of this. And Madri gets his arse kicked royally by um, the real San Miguel and the real Estrella. Um, I've been to Spain many, many times. Oh, and Estrella. Oh, it's the lager of gods. But that, no. Um, will I drink it again? Absolutely never. Um, out of five, well, I'm sorry, but it's a three out of five. Yep, as bad as that. Cheers.